everyone welcome back to another video so today's video as you can tell from the title it's going to be a what's in my flight attendant bag video i have been making videos like this since i started youtube but it's been a while since i did the last one so a lot has changed and i want to show you guys what is in here so the bag that i use is probably one of my favorite bags in the entire world this is by nomad lane i worked with them in the past this isn't sponsored by them or anything but i absolutely love this bag it's literally the perfect flight attendant bag it has all the compartments that i need it's just perfect so definitely go get yourself one of these if you're a flight attendant because they're definitely worth it if you're new to my channel my name is ali and i'm an orlando based flight attendant and i vlog about my life as a flight attendant i bring you along my trips and i also vlog about other life stuff so make sure to click that subscribe button and make sure to turn your notifications on so that you never miss a video and then also make sure to follow me on instagram i'm pretty active there as well and i show you a lot of behind the scenes so make sure to follow me there as well so let's get started with the first compartment that is in this bag one of the things that i keep in here all the time is some sort of essential oil i love essential oils if you guys have been with me for a while you know that essential oils have been a huge part of my life and i decided to try this brand called simply earth they reached out to me and they said hey do you want to partner with us and i said okay sure let's try it and i've actually been using this for a while now for a couple months now actually and this is the mover soother roll-on so i actually made this myself simply earth sends out a subscription box that you can get in the mail with essential oils with everything that you're going to need to create your own recipe for essential oils so it comes with the recipe cards and it tells you how to make soaps it tells you how to make creams it tells you how to make all sorts of different things so this one actually my box actually had the recipe to make this and this is for muscles like sore muscles i get really bad lower back pain and especially right now that i'm back into working out i have been rolling this on at the end of the day especially after a long day of flying i like to rub this in the bottom of my feet and just kind of give myself a massage because walking in heels around that airport especially salt lake city if you've ever been to salt lake city or atlanta airport you know how big those airports can be and walking around in heels can definitely hurt your feet so it comes with directions you just apply to areas of soreness it comes with the ingredients the ingredient the ingredients are pretty much just bergamot essential oil cage put cage put i'm not sure how to say that relief and uh coconut oil and that's it so you can diffuse the essential oils you can rub them on yourself with you know once they're diluted and everything so the subscription box comes with six recipes and you can create your own concoctions like i said and one of the things that i really like about simply earth and one of the reasons why i decided to work with them is that they donate 13 percent of their profits to organizations who aim to end human trafficking so as flight attendants that is something that we get trained on and it's very important to me so i'm really glad to partner up with a company that fights against this so one thing that i really think is important is the ability to be able to use natural products i am not 100 percent natural like i'm not like super crunchy i do try to keep it natural as much as i can so that's one of the reasons why i have incorporated essential oils i've actually used essential oils my entire life my dad has always used essential oils on me ever since i was little so they've been a huge part of my life and i'm really excited to get to know this brand and really work with them and get to know how their essential products work also each box has a value of over a hundred dollars compared to other essential oil companies and when you use my link and use my code you will get a 45 dollars gift card for you to be able to use on your next purchase so once again i would like to thank simply earth for sponsoring a portion of this video and honestly if you're into essential oils give this a try and let me know what you think so moving on i always keep this in this front pocket right here and also i keep my kindle in there buying a kindle was probably one of the best things i ever did as a flight attendant i read a lot especially when i'm in my jump seat and i've already done all my flight attendant duty one of the ways to pass the time as a flight attendant so having all my books in here is just so convenient i'm not the type of person that cares whether it's a physical book or a digital book as long as i have all my books in one place like this is better and i'd rather have this than just carrying everything around like carrying a whole bunch of books i have a butterfly clip in there just to put my hair up during service i have a lipstick this is by rare beauty in the shade humble and i've only used this once because it was pretty but i didn't think it looked that good on me then i keep a fizz stick that my friend natalie gave me and then i have a little perfume bottle this is the valentino i'm not sure what kind it is but 
it smells so good i smelled this on a friend once and i just had to go and buy it i love perfumes i've said it before perfumes are just so so good if you hear my kids in the background they're upstairs playing so they've been very loud today <laughs> some blotting sheets in case i get oily throughout the day which i do but i haven't had to use them yet and then i have a pen and my apple pencil this is the first generation pen because i have a very old ipad which i'll show you in a minute because i do keep that in here and i think that's it i have a cord that can be connected to a power bank and you put it in here and you can connect your phone and charge it from here so it's pretty convenient i think that's pretty cool if you can see right here there are two little pouches that you can put in these little organizers that actually come with the bag and in here i just keep deodorant i keep hand sanitizer i have some ibuprofen in there some more hand sanitizer hand lotion poopery more hand lotion i have some colgate wisps the poopery is very important because if you are a flight attendant you know that when you're working those very early flights a lot of people like to use the bathroom and it's just not always the best smelling time of the day on the plane so it's very important to carry some sort of air freshener so i have poopery in there always in this other pocket right here i have all of my tech stuff this is where i keep anything for my camera and vlogging so i have my um little adapter for my memory back my memory card i have a nail file that's weird i don't know why i have one there <laughs> an extra apple watch charger an adapter power bank and my camera batteries so these little containers come with the nomad lane bag when you purchase which i think is pretty neat and i like that it just keeps everything organized in its own little place and then when you open up the main compartment so in here i don't really keep much in here but I keep my iPad and I use my iPad as a planner. So I always, always have it in on me. And then in this pocket right here, I have my work iPad and my phone charger. I always keep those in there. I don't take them out unless I am getting ready to charge everything to go to work. This last compartment right here is where I keep a lot of more random things. So in here I have more spray. I have a hand sanitizer. I have my service apron so i put this on every time i do service um, this hand sanitizer pouch that goes on my apron i got this sleeve for my iced coffee so that when i get iced coffee at the airport i can just put this in there and then it'll just make it seem like it's my drink and then it won't sweat and just go get wet all over the place i have some body spray because that's important after a long day of flying I have my little tripod for my camera for when I'm vlogging. This is actually a really good one because it expands so you can do this. And it also has, it's a little tripod slash stand. So I think it's pretty cool. And then I have this little notebook that a hotel gave us for just staying there. They gave that to us as a gift. And I keep my flight attendant shoes in there. And these are what I would say my cabin shoes are. So I change into these as soon as I get on the plane because i don't like wearing heels on the plane in case there's turbulence i don't want to you know like twist my ankle get hurt or anything so i have some rothies and i actually just got these rothies maybe a few months ago and rothies are a little expensive if you if you're familiar with them but i really like the fact that they're washable so if they ever start to get you know a little dirty or whatever you can always just throw them in the washer and you're good and you know these are shoes that i'm going to be wearing for a long time as long as i'm a flight attendant I have some gum in here more hand sanitizer apparently i carry a lot of hand sanitizer i have a boarding pass which is trash a pen and then apparently some nail glue and that is it for that last compartment i told you guys i carry a lot of random stuff in there and then my favorite part about this bag this is what made it very convenient for me is that there's another pocket right here so this is what goes on the handle of your suitcase right here but in here, I can keep my passport. So when I'm going through KCM, all I have to do is just open up that zipper and take out my passport and then just show it to them and go, you know, through KCM. But as flight attendants, we're always required to carry our passport as well as our work iPad because our work iPad is our manual as well. And without that, you can get fined. And then your passport, you're always supposed to have because you never know when you can divert and go to another country or go somewhere else where you might need your passport. So 
very important. I have another <laughs> boarding pass and two more lipsticks. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk. And then this is one that I wear pretty much all the time. And it's the YSL Vinyl Cream in 407. I always get questions when I wear this, when I post about it on Instagram. And this is pretty much the lipstick I'm always wearing. Or Hellcat, which is the one that I'm wearing now by Cat Eye Cosmetics. But yeah, that is it for this video. That is all that I have in my bag. I wanted to show you guys this little keychain that I got from a coworker of mine who owns her own company. And she actually makes these herself. So I thought they were really cute. I'm gonna link this down below. And anything that I got from Amazon, I'm also going to link it in the description box below so you guys are able to pick some stuff up. I'm also going to leave a link in the description box for Simply Earth so you guys are able to try out the essential oils and make some cool recipes for yourself. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if it's your first time here and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.